So, Boy Meets World actor exposes Hollywood. Let's get into it. Let's roll the intro, guys. This is Sparta! What is up, guys? It's your boy, Hercules, and well... If you guys don't know, Matthew Lawrence, a.k.a. the actor that I believe he played, uh, man, who did he play? He played Eric's friend. I forgot the name of the character, but uh, Matthew Lawrence, he's uh, he comes from a very talented family that uh, is in has been in the Hollywood business for many, 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 many years. Um, but uh, he, he's been known for a lot of roles, but... Uh, Mainly, I, I, the only ones that I remember is from Boy Meets World. Now, supposedly, Matthew Lawrence has has come out in uh, in their podcast, and he revealed that he was supposed to be getting a Marvel role. Now, he doesn't doesn't go into fully details, but uh, he's he was usually talking about the Me Too era and how a lot of in the Me Too era they only focus on the female, which is true. They only focus on the female, but there's a lot of guys there. I bet if you go into the records, and like if you had a record, a lot of guys were me too into the whole era. But you know, guys don't talk about it. Guys don't, they don't want to come out. If it happened, it happened, they'll, they'll just let it pass, right? But I mean, we all know if something happens to a man, Nobody cares. But if it happens to a female, oh my God, the world's ending, people. But let's get back to the topic. So he reveals that he was auditioning for this role in a Marvel character or for this Marvel role. Now, we don't know if it's from Disney or if it's Fox or whatever. And he reveals that his agent or his uh, agency, I believe that's how he said it that uh, told him to go to this hotel, go to this room, and he was going to meet the director. Well, the director comes in, and he's in this, like a, like a bathrobe, pretty much. And it's telling Matthew Lawrence to take off his shirt, his clothes, and to do some acts. I don't know what he means by acts. My guess, like, I don't know. Like, I don't know. I, I'm just guessing what he meant but could be sexual acts or dance pose whatever you know um and he declined he he, he declined everything he actually walked out and next thing you knew he didn't get the role and his agency dropped him this just proves to people that woke Hollywood has always been disgusting. This just proves that as much as they try to make it look like they're not these uh, pedals in Hollywood, there always is. They're still there. You have the lady that was the assistant for Harvey Weinstein still getting job after she knew the only reason why she's not part of the Me Too era was because she's an ugly bitch. But she's still getting roles. She was there. She saw people. She knew what was happening. Never said a damn thing. Well, Hollywood, you would always still be a weird place. A disgusting place. And as much as you try to change your image, you will always be pedals, in my opinion. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, make sure to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time.